So what's going on guys? My name is Noah. Welcome back to the channel. So, um, we last left off where the group was captured by Carver, right? Yeah, that's where we finished episode two. So, yeah, here we go. All right. We're gonna... On the walking dead. God damn it, Lee. Every time I hear his voice, that's all I'm gonna say. God damn it, Lee. Who do you think? Stop did reminding this? me of what happened. Think about it. You're Carver, what do you do? I got my coffee. What's the most important thing in this world? Heh, <laughs> this bitch here. Clem, it's family. People like Matthew aren't coming back. <laughs> Saved his ass. I'm telling you, man. Rebecca, our baby deserves to be raised. In a place of safety. Ah! Ah! Go to hell, you fuck. Anyways, no time. Just shot my boy straight in the head. We're going home. As a family. Why well, I feel like Clem got more balls than a lot of these dudes out here. Oh boy. Yeah, I was about to say, what the hell are you staring at? Oh, the, the butterfly? Eat it. <laughs> you got done over there? Yeah, one second. Thanks for coming with me. It's scary out here. I know they made you. It's still nice that you came. We're friends. Friends look out for one another. We are, aren't we? Well, if you need to pee, let me know. I'll keep look out for you, too. Uh, okay. Thanks. Appreciate that. Well, hell you want, asshole. Everything come out all right, girls. The fuck? Yeah. Troy, get them tied up. Will do. Well, we're on our way. Probably 30 minutes out. Make sure everyone's prepped. Emotions might be running high. Carver out. Fucking Carver. If I find out you've been wasting fuel to keep that fucking heater going, I'll make you walk back. Nope. Froze my ass off. Just like you told me to. It ain't polite to listen to other folks' conversations. Has anyone ever taught you that? Where's your manners? I'm sorry. It's okay, honey. We'll chalk it up as a lesson learned, all right? Get the girls in back with the rest <laughs> of I should have been a smart ass. We've got a bit of a drive ahead of us. You're giving me the Negan, like, kind of feel. I, I still think Negan's a lot better. Yeah. That's just me, but he, the way he is, is kind of giving me that Negan feel. Are you guys okay? The hell did he do to you? Hey, did he hurt you? Hey, hey! <laughs> Baby, I know you probably don't know what I just said, but Negan is from the show, The Walking Dead. Probably one of the best parts of the show. Kenny! Oh boy. You ain't even gonna ask your wife no questions. Yeah, everybody just sitting in silence. I'm surprised they ain't got somebody watching us. Come on, Kenny, say something. I know you're going to. All right, we got to do something. Come on. Anyone got anything sharp? Anything? We need to get these bindings off. Hey, Clem, help me find something to get these off. Anything sharp that could cut these. And what good is that gonna do? The hell is wrong with you people? We gotta get out of here. The truck's empty. First off, we're in it, so it ain't exactly empty. If you don't want to help, then just say so, okay? I'll do it myself. God damn it, Kenny. We're in a fucking precarious position here. We gotta do something about Settle that. Settle down, Kenny. They took everything. We have to keep a level head. He's right. You don't know Bill like we do. Bill? This whole time it's Carver, Carver, Carver. Now he's fucking Bill. 
Oh, I see what it is. Y'all are just getting a ride home, aren't you? That's what's going on here. Say that again. I'd stay out of this, boy. Mister, oh, I ain't shit. A boy. No, right. You're a man. You don't understand. He's different. It's worse. The fuck are you talking about? He wants to punish us. You could have warned us. Yeah, you didn't tell us he was a fucking psychopath. You have no idea what you're dealing with. So oh, he gave tell me a pretty me. good goddamn idea back at the lodge. And I don't intend to sit around here and let that happen to the rest of us. I'm trying to help. I'm sure Walter really appreciated your help. That's not fair. You're blaming him for the actions of a madman. I am pointing out that regardless of intent, there are consequences to rash actions. Something that he seems to be misreading as capitulation. I don't know what the fuck you're saying, but I know it's bullshit. We have to do something. Kenny, you can't reason with it. Oh shit. Jackpot. Sit down. You're going to get us all killed. Y'all don't know what you're talking about. We get cooped up in some kennel like a bunch of fucking dogs. It's over. You don't know that. Yeah? Well, I've been in this situation before. You ever mm. been a prisoner? We've all been prisoners. Why do you think we left? Kenny's right. We have to do something. We can't just sit here. How is it the kid is the only one that sees what's going on here? Clem, the adults are talking. What did you just say Is that, that what this is? All right. Now we're talking. Carver will be on the other side of that door with ten people. <laughs> There, there, baby. It's okay. Everything's gonna be fine. At this point, maybe Luke is the only hope we have. Oh yeah, he's Luke! do something, he'd have done it by now. Who knows what he's dealing with? Anything can happen out there. I'll tell you what happened. He abandoned us. You don't know that. I know he ain't here. He may not be around, but he wouldn't just leave us behind. That guy's a flake. I could tell the second I set eyes on him. Kenny, please calm down, please. I'm calm, Sarita. I look angry to you. We'll have to wait and see. It's all we can do. She's right. There's no way to know what's happened to him. I told you already. He's gone. <sighs> Kenny's lost so much that a lot of his decisions, he's not. We're close. He has okay, the right intent, but guns. a lot of them. What exactly do you expect to do? I'm going to punch the first son of a bitch I see. Then I'm going to take his gun and use it to shoot the next son of a bitch I see. Just sit down. Shut up, Doc. This ain't your call. Hey, just, if something happens, just help out, okay? Don't, you know, get yourself hurt or nothing, but any help would be good. Hey, Clem, look at me. You trust me, right? Yes. Kenny, please, just, just listen to them. Yeah, okay, I trust you. I'll, I'll do what I can. All right, it's okay to be a little scared, but we gotta do this. Gotta do it for Uncle Kenny. All right. Everybody ready? Kenny! Uh, Kenny, are you okay? Oh, so okay? much for that. I think so. Oh, what hit me? It's probably for the best. Man, he's not he's gonna be untied. They're gonna be like this fucking guy here. Alright, up and at him. And Kenny's loose. Ah no! Not the fuck! How'd you get your restraints off? Come here. Oh boy. We've got some familiar faces back with us tonight. Hmm, <laughs> Carver's on the fucking I microphone. I understand some of you are confused as to why we bring these people back when they left us as they did. I think I've got an idea. Now, it might not come all at once, but time will heal these wounds. So be patient with them until it does. And take solace in knowing that they're here to help us make our home a better place. All these feelings you have of anger, I always say it. There's no way in hell I'd be able to put up with this. No way in hell. But we do have to find it in our hearts to forgive them. Look how much food they have. Damn. Oh, I hope you ain't saying what I think you're saying. Damn it, Especially Kenny. We know a large herd of lurkers gathers just south of us. Come on. We need you for something. Can I wait until morning? We're all exhausted. Just come the fuck on. Nothing we can't handle. Some I need him. I need my dad. I, I can't. He's... He looks and after me. They have been taken into consideration. However, this is not up for debate. Damn. The expansion project. He'll be back. When? Oh, I God. don't know. But he will come back. Thanks, Clem. 
And with the added manpower joining us this evening, I have no doubt that we will continue Make sure y'all stay off the fans. Bill can it's save no you from messing enough. with it. Just to survive, it's our obligation to make this community a beacon of hope. Thanks, Barney. Yep. To provide a light, a bright light, bright enough to shine in all this darkness. So that is what we'll do. Y'all best get some rest, because there ain't gonna be much for you tomorrow. You're gonna be working hard. Damn. That's for you. Yeah, it would be. Fucking Bill. Keeps me out in the cold, but at least I'll be comfortable. Hey, guys. Reggie! <gasps> oh my god! Where's your arm? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry. What did they do to you? This could have been worse, trust me. I'm lucky to be alive. It's my fault. No, it's really not. I would tell you if it was. This happened well after you guys left. I guess I should Reggie say helped us you, but when we ran away. I know. I feel the same way. What happened to his arm? I don't know. We were all running out together. But then he fell. And everybody kept running. Damn. I know he had both his arms then. Damn, they probably cut that shit yeah, off. Working outside. Lurkers. Snuck oh, up on me okay. while I was hammering something. Luckily, they took the arm off quick. Saved my life. Ali! I'm so sorry. Look, it was my choice to help you guys. Alvin, Carver wants you in his office. What? Why? Don't make this difficult. It's too late for that. No, please. It's okay, Beck. Just get some rest. If he wanted to do something to me, he'd have done it already. I'll be fine. Let's see what she wants. know damn well he ain't gonna be fine. He gonna tell him, hey man, that ain't hey, your baby, really? that's my baby. Oh. Hey, Troy. Don't go fucking up now. Bill's real close to letting you out of here. You make sure things stay nice and quiet out here tonight, and I'll be sure to let Bill know just how helpful you were. Yeah, you can count on me. Thanks, Troy. Don't mention it. Oh boy. Dissension. I thought they were oh, gonna right. beat the shit we out of Kenny. You. We were with them when we got caught. Hey, I'm Reggie. That's Sarita. Hello. And that's Kenny. Hey ya. Hello. Hey ya. Hey ya. Hey ya. This freaks me. It doesn't off. matter. My name's Clementine. It's very nice to meet you, Clementine. Hey, where's Carlos? Bill's already got him looking at some folks. Oh, okay. Good. What about Pete? He did. <laughs> he did. Can you guys save it for the morning? Some of us got to be up early. Who's that? I don't know. I don't recognize the voice. I no do. No problem. Sorry about that. Okay, that's Mike. He's kind of a dick when he's tired, but like I said, he saved my life, so I put up with that shit. Bill put him to work outside the wall with me. I'm so sorry. Stop with all the sorry. It was my choice. Besides, he said once you oh were all caught, he let me rejoin God, the group, so man. I'm glad you're here. I'm just joking. I know. I mean, he did say that, but I'm not happy about it. Who's she? Hmm? Who? The girl over there. Oh, yeah, right. Okay, so she's fucking weird. They found her sneaking around outside the camp covered in guts and just like the grossest shit. It's probably best not to stare. I know how it must look, but it's really not that bad here. Reggie. No, I'm serious. Where else are you going to find food like we have? We've got the canned stuff, and now with the greenhouses coming along, we've got fresh food. The building's getting more and more secure all the time, mostly through forced labor, but that's only temporary. They've even got the solar panels working. When was the last time you had electricity, huh? Well, we just came from a lodge with a wind turbine. It's not a competition. I'm just saying, it's not as bad as you think. Damn! <laughs> We're building something great here, guys. A real community. Bill is making it happen. Look, I've made mistakes, and he's forgiven me. That doesn't make up for what he's done, Reggie. I know that, but I'm starting to see what this place offers. I didn't before, and with the accident, it's just that much more important now. Carver killed my friend Walter. 
Yeah, how do you justify okay. that? I don't know what happened. But maybe he had his reasons. His reason is he's a crazy piece of shit. Listen, I'm really close to getting let back into the group. Once that happens, I can do a lot more to help you guys be more comfortable. Comfortable? What do you think this is? I just don't want you to mess things up for me. I've worked really hard to get to this point. Will you please just try not to cause any trouble? At least until they release me. Then, once I'm out, I could help you more. Maybe even help get you out. We won't get you in trouble. They're expecting me to keep things in line out here. Well, if Carver's such a great guy, I'm sure you've got nothing to worry about. We can at least talk about it more in the morning. Just have a quiet night and chat again tomorrow. I can't believe what I'm hearing. Look, the fact is, Bill had every reason to kill me when I helped you guys, but he didn't. Obviously, I don't know what happened while you were all gone, but he's given me a second chance, and I know he'd do the same for you. Mm-hmm. Reggie, I don't want a second chance. I want to leave with my family. That's it. Your family is safer here. <gasps> I need to sit down. Yeah, come on. Sarah, can you go see if there's something for her to drink? Okay. Yeah, there's water over by the benches. Ah, oh, that didn't go as planned. Should have actually made a plan. Hi, Kenny. And fuck that guy. I don't think we can trust him. I mean, clearly he's already drank too much of the Kool-Aid. I don't trust him either. He acts... strange. Yeah. I guess getting part of your body chopped off can do that to a fella. You gotta mm. take a look around. We gotta know if there's anything we can exploit to get out of here. We're in a tight spot. Gonna have to wriggle our way out. Well, what should I be looking for? Stuff that they don't want us to know about. That Troy asshole's gone for now. This is our chance. Don't worry about Reggie. I'll go help run interference on him. Why is it I always gotta do something? Why can't I run interference? Walker just snuck up on you, huh? Yep, I was uh, distracted. Just wasn't thinking, there's all kinds of noise, hammering and stuff. Mm. I saw its shadow, it moved in front of one of our work lamps down here and knocked it over. Couldn't even see for a second. What That's does... What it Damn, they boarded the shit out of this. I can't either, honestly. Well, this place Walker seems pretty talk. secure. I doubt it. I mean, I could see a few cracks that the walkers can get through. I don't want to put my hands on it right away. Looks kind of crappy. Yeah. I saw a fella try that a few months ago. Nick. Just ended up bleeding out. Ended up turning anyway. Yeah, like I said, it felt like hmm. it looks before. rickety. Guess it's better than the ground. It's not. Yeah. I like how he put in his two cents. I'm just gonna stare at a random woman. So, how did you end up with a name like Reggie? Kenny! What? I'm just asking. No, it's okay. It's not my real name. Well, my first name the US, and I stopped. Hmm. I don't even know what the fuck that is, but. I mean, I, I'm obviously supposed to be looking at the wall, so. And that's when I thought I should really get out ahead of this. I guess. Pole on fence. All right, well, fuck it. That's what we'll do, right? Mm. Hey, Clem, come on. Don't be like that. She ain't doing nothing wrong, Reggie. Just relax. How can I relax when she's walking around touching everything? Hmm. Ouch. Yeah, you ain't getting through that. They make this is a damn prison. They making sure ain't nobody getting out this bitch. Okay. A ladder. A broken ladder at that. They really they made sure 
Ain't nobody getting out this bitch. Hmm. I mean, that's pretty much it, right? I don't see anything else. Hmm. Fuck it, just touch it. I don't. I don't know. <laughs> Clementine, please. I asked really nicely. I don't want hey, to. What the hell is she doing? No, uh, nothing. <laughs> you know, kids. They love not listening. You had one job, Reggie. This is real disappointing. Gonna have to tell Bill about this. Please, Damn. come on. Hey, don't be like that, man. You shut your fucking mouth. I don't know you. Damn. Dad! Oh, you all fucked up now. Bill's gonna hear about this shit. Troy, please. Fuck you, Reggie. This is setting you back a few. Get comfortable, asshole. He was trying to help. She's just a kid. No one's talking to you, Indian lady. Hey! Damn! I am Indian. Everybody get to bed. Well, I don't fucked up for everybody. Some of these folks ain't too keen on leaving. It's up to us to figure out a way out of here. You up for it? It's your decision. I'm ready. Of course I am. Good, good. Confidence is good. You gotta have the right attitude. Now get some sleep. We'll need it. Fucking Kenny, man. <laughs> oh, man. What would Lee do if he was here, honestly? Damn! Can I help you? Don't kick me. It's rude. Get up. Bill's gonna have a word. All right, all right. You ain't gotta point the gun at me. I'm up, I'm up. There's been increased walker activity along the fence, so be mindful when outside the walls. The herds moved a little closer as of this morning, but that still doesn't necessarily mean we'll be hit. No, we're monitoring the situation. Now, there are some folks might be sore about what happened and how things went. Well, that's all in the past now. This fucking asshole. <laughs> I blew your head, friend's head off, but uh, don't Some worry about that. Some of you are new to our community. Some of you are members who went astray. But know that you can find redemption here. Forgiveness. By proving your worth through what will undoubtedly be hard work. You know, Reggie slipped up last night, but that doesn't mean he should lose hope. Today will be a test for him. So let's all wish him the best of luck. How'd you sleep? I'll let Reggie be an example to you all. I'm so tired. Salvation is available, but it I didn't even must be earned. That. Pay attention. Kenneth will be we'll taking over later. Reggie's okay. duties outside the okay, walls. Okay, yeah. Sounds good. Michael will continue on I showing his value. Nice finally... Carlos! Shut the fuck up, man! Yes? Your child seems to be in need of correction. I'm... Sorry, I... Sarah, apologize to Mr. Carver. S I'm sorry, sir. No, no, that ain't gonna cut it. I can't have this kind of behavior on day one of your reform. You discipline her now, Carlos. How do you propose that one I... One good smack across the mouth should do it. It'll make her think twice before opening it up again. Go on, we'll wait. Damn. Wait. I'm not sure with my hand that I. Well, could. that's why you got two hands, Carlos. Come on, not some namby pamby thing, all right? A good hard smack. Otherwise, Troy here will do like... it for you. Damn. Now, if you want that, he can be overzealous. Is that the word? If it means I'll slap the shit out of her, then yeah. Go on, Carlos. Just get it over with. <laughs> I'm sorry. You 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 kept opening your mouth, so you you pay the price. I'm not getting smacked. Hell no. 
I'm sorry, Dad. I'm Close sorry. Close your eyes, honey. It's only going to sting for a second. Just smack her, goddammit! Do it. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> Ooh. I'm sorry, Sarah. Stop! You're not cuddling that girl anymore. Let her sit there and think about what she's done. Troy, get Carlos to his post. Everyone else should have their assignments. It's time to get to work. And it's because they protected her so long, God like... damn. You really knocked the shit out of her, Doc. Everyone get to work. Like, they coddled her so much that she has no idea of the outside world, me. no nothing. She's just oblivious so and she's so... God damn this thing. Oh, shit. Could have killed somebody. And, um... Like, Who's you, you can't do that, especially in a world like this. She was with Carlos and Sarah. Uh, and Sarah? I wish she'd stay gone. She's had a hard time, Becca. So have we. We're not sitting on the ground like babies. Why everybody gotta talk shit? Don't nobody ever just Go get... on inside. Bonnie's waiting. Oh my god. Yeah, this'll be fun. Hey, I guess you're starting your day with me. We're cool. loading magazines. Well, that's it. You got it. I'm not saying it's not. It's not hard. I mean, realistically. I suppose I owe you an Fuck apology. Fuck you! I wasn't truthful when I came across y'all at the lodge, and I was shown a kindness I never would have expected from a group of strangers. But... Now, give me a choice. Dead, give, if you give me a choice, say fuck you. I'm gonna say I fuck you. But feel I'm to blame. But the plan was for no one to get hurt. I truly believe that was the intent. At least it was mine going into it. That's because it's your fault. You led them to us. If I could change it, I would. I promise fuck you. you. I should believe you now. All I know about you is that you're a liar. Yeah, exactly. I understand you're mad at me, and you've got every right to be. But I wanted you to know I regret my part in all of this. Man. I apologize. Which don't account for much, but it's all I can offer right now. And if they would have killed me and pretty much all my group, then what? How was your We're first all night dead, in the but you have a guilty I know conscience. It ain't so comfortable, but it's safe. Which is more than I can say about a lot of places out there. You mean my first night in prison? It ain't a prison. More of a work release. A prison. Do, do those in prisons? Well, I. <laughs> Clem. I don't know. I never been to prison. Don't tell no one. Trying to keep a tough reputation. Man, I was listen. To go. Man, when listen. Luke and Carlos and all them left. I was planning on leaving too. When Luke approached me about it, I I thought he was crazy. I mean, we're safe here. We got power, we got food. They never mentioned you. No? Hmm. Uh, not even Luke? Well, I mean, that's to be expected, ain't it? You don't know me, do you? What are they gonna say? Well, Bonnie ain't here? You wouldn't know what he was talking about. I guess that could be it. I justified not going by telling myself it's easier to So why didn't they all know her, though? Like, nobody knew who she was, right? right? I didn't hear anyone say, hey, Bonnie, occurred, or Bonnie, don't do this. That's the type of thing that rips a community apart. He keeps things in line. He's got a lot of this stuff figured out. I don't know. I guess I just wanted to be somewhere comfortable for a while. Nobody's safe here with Carver around. You're safe if you stay on his good side. Well, well how what safe is that? It was. I mean, it ain't easy keeping a group this big fed and protected. I don't envy that position. Figured that'd make anyone a little stressed. I'm not That's defending what he did. That was... <sighs> I'm alive because of him. That's just a fact. And there's something to that. He killed Walter. Only to protect his own people. Kenny could have killed us all. But he didn't. Bill overreacted. He was in the heat of the moment and That's he overreacted. Him. That's him. Luke had ideas about how things should go, but they didn't line up with what Bill was thinking. 
They butted heads. Then Rebecca started showing, and that only made things worse. Maybe Luke was right about him. I wish he was around, but I just hope he's safe. Hey, Bonnie, is that girl down there? I need to come get her. Yeah, she's here. Okay, I'll be right over. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, almost forgot. I grabbed this for you. Now we're fucking friends. Huh? What do you think? Cool. I found it at the lodge y'all were at. Wow, thanks. I think it might be for skiing. Had to wait for no one to be around to get it to you. It's kind of ugly. Really? I thought it was kind of cute. Well, this ain't a fashion show. It'll keep you warm. You better watch yourself. I think some folks might be jealous of that cool jacket of yours. He's trying too hard oh, to be friends. Are. What's with the ugly jacket? Tavia. What? Never mind. I'll see you later, Clementine. Come on. Follow me. I can't, Come on. I can't stand people like that, bro. Like, you literally got some of my people killed. It's not like you interfered. But I am sorry, my deepest condolences, my apologies. I hope that makes you feel better. Fuck you, all right? Stay in here for a minute. I'm gonna radio down and find out what you're doing. Don't touch anything. Sarah's in here, oh my God. <laughs> this is what happened when you fucking, yo baby, hey. it's gonna be okay. Everything you can. Don't worry about it, baby. You want a hug okay well i owe you one for later then you might not know what's coming though but i could just sneak up on you when you're not expecting it my dad's never hit me before nah fuck that i know he i'm gonna have to hit my kid bad. he never hit me he didn't want to do it sarah carver made him he's the bad guy not your dad so, in a weird way, Carver's the one that hit you, not your dad. I guess so. Carver hit me super hard, because it still hurts like crazy. Yeah, <laughs> it looked like it. You smacked the I shit out of you. Why people have to be so mean? Like, even when I'm really mad, I still don't want to hurt anyone. I understand that, but... Oh god, it's you. Don't mess this up. Yeah, I get it. Reggie's in charge here, okay? Listen to him carefully. Yep. Oh God, no problem, me and Sarah? Well, <sighs> okay, we gotta do a good job, guys. The camp is counting on us. Whatever the fuck that means. Come on, I'll show you what to do. It's super easy. Oh, and just so you know, Bill yelled at me this morning for what you were doing last night. I'm not mad, but please, please just listen to me today. I'm on like the thinnest ice with that guy. Pick up a pair of those shears. Okay, so we're picking these berries, right? Just pick them, put them in the basket. Simple. While you're at it, if you see any dead branches, take those shears and cut them off and stack them neatly for composting. Got it? Am I really gonna have to do this? Oh, shit. Hey, so... Is she gonna be okay? Cause what happened down there? That was straight fucked up. I don't want her freaking out and getting me in trouble. She's a baby. There's no helping her. Whoa, that's harsh, kid. I think if Bill did that to me, I'd cry a little too. Look. Are you a fucking pansy? Since I helped those guys escape, so I gotta concentrate on my work. <laughs> the fuck? What do I look like to you? Yeah, you see that was face? Awkward. I won't do that again. I'm gonna go work now. Dude, you're fucking weird, man. I don't know. Maybe you should have died after you got bit. Oh, thank God. She's going to do it. I, I can't do this shit. This is perfect foreshadowing. All I know is that if... Because, you know, there's a herd of what... Have a heart, Noel. Hey. Here, watch me. I 
And then my work's gonna be nothing. And then they're gonna be like, Clem, you didn't do shit, but Sarah did everything. Look at you. What the fuck did you do? This isn't that hard, Sarah. I know. I'm just afraid I'll make a mistake. It won't be the end of the world if you do. Just keep going. Ah, oh, shit. Oh, no. You didn't do any of your work, Clem. <laughs> just checking in. See how the new girls are working out. Oh boy. Reggie. Yeah, Bell. Hey. What the fuck happened in here? Look, Bell, they're new, and me with my arm, it's just not the easy I just have I have one shut arm. Shut up, the shut up. Shut the fuck up. Ah shit. Sure. You better have an explanation for this. And I mean now. Bill, please, just Sounds just... like you were about to give me an excuse. When I asked for an explanation. We'll get it done. Just give us some more time. We just... Time's up, Reggie. You had a task. You didn't get it done. Looks to me like you failed. It was my fault. I didn't show Sarah well enough. I guess. No, this ain't your fault. We talked about this, Reggie. Didn't we? But you just don't get it, do you? Damn. Like what? I... I... Why don't you girls wait outside? Reggie and I have a few things to talk about. Sarah's gonna be the death of somebody, man. I'm telling you, man. She she's too Thanks like the help girls. She's so fro poor Reggie. She's so frozen. Like everything. If a walker appears in front of her, she's finished. Cause she'll literally just be. What's wrong, Sarah? Fuck what's wrong? Oh god! <laughs> Jump! Do it! This isn't Life is Strange, so I'm not gonna save you. <laughs> That's fucked Are you up. Okay? No, I will protect. Oh shit! I gave you plenty of chances. No, 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 please! Weakness, incompetence. It puts us all at risk, and it won't be tolerated. You think about that the next time you're asked to do something. Oh god! Now she's really frozen. Get downstairs. Bonnie's got some stuff for you to do. Go! Ah, uh, Sarah? <sighs> oh, God, I'm with you again? Oh, hey. So, they want you to run some supplies out to the guys working at the expansion? Real simple, just take this over to them. That jacket looks real nice. Shut the fuck up! Shut up! We're not fucking What's friends. Wrong? Fuck you, man. Clem? You alright? You look like you've seen a ghost. Fuck you. I'm fine. You don't look it. Fuck you, what do you care? Look, I know it's hard, but things will be alright. I ain't snitching! As bad as I don't seems. trust you! Just take this stuff out to the guys and come on back. I'm gonna go check if there ain't something easier you could be doing. Hey, Troy! Clem's just gonna take them boys some nails! All right. Go on. Damn. Hey, that ain't your concern. Get that stuff over to them boys. Just follow them cables. Okay. Whatever you say, buddy. Nah, they gonna bust through that shit. That shit ain't stable. Yeah, they gonna go through that. I ain't nobody's laborer. Fuck that. Let them do this shit themselves if it's so goddamn important. Get your fucking hands off you me. You ain't gonna force me to do this bullshit. You said get your hands off me. Or what? You gonna go tail on me? I'm trying to help you, asshole. Yeah, this is a real help. Why don't you just worry about yourself? Get off me! You're one of them, aren't you? Stop fighting! I want to, Clem, but this son of a bitch keeps. I just want to get the work done. And <laughs> shit! Oh <laughs> shit! They busted through. Why must I fight? <laughs> Bonk! <laughs> oh shit! Run! 
Clem! Run! Oh my god! I ain't gonna lie, that's creepy as hell. I'm stuck! No! Clem! Damn! You wanna talk about luck? What? I don't think she could swing that. That worked. Alright. <laughs> I know Lee raised you, but we ain't gotta be like him. Ah, get it off! Get up. Get out of there. Come on. Make me save your ass. Jesus. <sighs> Where were you? Oh, thank God you're okay. All right, enough mushy shit. You get back inside right fucking now. I'm sure they got shit for you to do in there. Now! Think I'm fucking around? Now I gotta sit down here and babysit you assholes. Can't do a simple fucking patch job without me here cracking the whip? I thought they busted through there. Y'all really about to make me walk all the way? Ah! Oh my god! Get off! Wait, is that Luke? Ah, stop! Hey, it's me! Luke! How'd you yes. get in here? Man, bit the hell out of me. Thank you, Drew Blood. Come all this way. This is, this is the welcome I get. I was worried. We all were. Nah, no, it's good to see you too, kid. All right, listen, we ain't got much time. Okay, I followed y'all here best I could. I haven't had a night's rest since y'all got nabbed. And, well, this is the first chance I got to talk to somebody. Damn. They're everywhere. Okay, they got guards watching everything. Shh, shh. There's a herd of lurkers just south of us. It's bigger than I ever seen around these parts. Carver mentioned that. Said he hopes it passes us. I heard folks talking about that, but that ain't so. Okay, it's gonna hit this place. I know it is. Now, I don't know when, but it's coming, and it's gonna be soon. See, I've been looking for places to, to get y'all free, but I haven't been able to find anything yet. They plugged up all the holes we used when we got out. Are you feeling okay? No. No, I mean, uh, yeah. Yes. Sorry. I, I just could use some sleep, you know? Hard to rest when you think a lurker's about to get the jump on you at any any moment, but yeah. <laughs> this dude sounds like he's on, like... I'm fine. <laughs> Okay, don't worry <laughs> Nothing but caffeine. It seems dangerous. Well, the whole situation's dangerous, but well, we're in it now. It's what we got. We just, we just need a plan. You no know, way to get you and, and everyone. You could tell that was a telltale game. You seen the way he just walked. Bigby did that same walk when he was what? thinking about something. That. Oh, sorry, sorry. Hand on the hip, okay, walking a little bit, had the head down. Listen, Clem, I need Damn. you to meet me here tomorrow about this time, because I, I need you to get me one of those radios, okay? Do you think you can do that? Just just one of those walkie-talkies. I just need to be able to tell y'all what's going on with them guards. You know, I'll figure out the schedule the patrols are on. I mean, they're they're all over the place, but I can keep an eye on them for y'all from out here. Look, we ain't gonna be able to shoot our way out of here, so we gotta be careful. We just gotta be smart, okay? We, we gotta plan. Where do I get one? I think they keep them in the stock room. I ain't completely sure, though. Just keep your eyes out for the charging station. Now, they put most of them back on there at night. Remember, you meet me here tomorrow. I'll try and be here around this time, but if I ain't, just wait as long as you can, because I really need one of those radios. And just let everybody know I'm all right, okay? I'm worried they, uh... Get out where I can see you. Go on. Get out of here. The hell were you doing? Huh? Answer me. I was hiding from walkers. Don't go in there, you hear me? That is off fucking limits to you. Bill Radio wants a word with you up in his office. Uh oh. So get on up there now. 
All right, Troy. She's lucky that she's still a little girl, that sometimes they give her a pass, because boy, oh boy. Uh-oh! <laughs> I want to know that conversation. Give me all that cheese, man. Please let me be in there when they're talking. Who the fuck is dude, this guy? you better go up and see Bill. He doesn't like to wait. Okay, dude! So, you should probably go. All right, dude. Uh oh. Rebecca. She's a strong woman, surrounded by weak men. I ain't letting my kid get raised around that. Now get in here. Oh, wait, is that him? Oh, he fucked him Alvin. up. Alvin. He passed out hours ago. He can't hear nothing. No point in making a racket. Why are you doing this? Me and him, we got history. Understand? A couple things we had to get worked out. This fucking guy I here, be man. I'm so concerned about his well-being if I were you. Not with you being so close to the fire yourself. Now. You make sure you tell me the truth when you're sitting where you are, and you won't end up over in that chair. Now, you might not believe this after what happened earlier, but I liked Reggie. He was a funny guy. He kept things light. You need folks like that. But I threw him off it's a fucking building. It's easy to sink in during times like this. But he was weak. And I don't mean just because he was maimed. That wasn't his problem. He was weak of will and weak of character. And we can't have that around here. Not anymore. Not with what we got at stake. You have to be able to contribute. I understand. I knew you were a smart girl. You see, Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screw-ups lately. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. This fucking guy it's one here, of man. the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. Do you understand? Well, I wish it was different, I do. But they are weak, and we are strong. That's why it's our responsibility to shepherd the flock, to keep them safe. It's their nature to follow, not to lead. I know. I have to do everything for them. It's exhausting. Of course it is. Mm -hmm. But that's the role you're meant to play. And we're more alike than you think. Hmm. There's no way you could have lasted this long otherwise. I realized that back in that cabin, you were scared. But you looked me straight in the eye. Kept your nerve. That's what we need. If we're gonna get through this, the next generation has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Hmm. Kids like you, raised the right way. The way my child will be raised. It ain't this herd that keeps me up at night. We can handle that. It's not knowing. If I got anyone to hand all this off to, but I ain't worried about that anymore. What if it's not yours? Well, even if that was true, it's mine now. Damn! All right, now. Bill, you there? Yeah, I'm here. The loading bay door is jacked. Troy really knocked the shit out of it. How bad is it? Rails are tweaked so it won't shut all the way. I don't think it's an emergency or anything, but it's something Stan should take a look at when he can. I'll get him on it. Out. That fucking idiot. Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. Go on back out to the yard. It's almost supper time. I'm just waiting for shit to hit the fan, cause... Well, where are we at? Damn, we 50 minutes into this shit? How long is this goddamn episode, man? Fuck. And they're already outside. Well, they've been outside, but the rest of the herd's coming. Cause we all know what happened this morning. I don't know what that son of a bitch is gonna do next. So you wanna ring the dinner bell for a herd of walkers to show up? How is that better? Cause this place will be fucking chaos when that thing hits. No one will be paying any attention to us. And that's when we go. It's our opening. We just gotta figure out a way to draw them to us. Your friend here wants to get us killed by lurkers before Bill can do it. What is it with you? That's what it sounds like to me. 
You know that's not what he's saying, but it does sound dangerous. This shit is all dangerous! Don't say Tony, Luke. Do not speak to me like that. Sound draws walkers. There was this girl, Molly. She used bells to control where they moved. Yeah, that's right. She had them running all over Crawford. We just need something loud. Well, unless you've got a megaphone tucked in your pocket, it doesn't help us much now. I still vote we get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. Oh, come on. You know How that, Luke? He flagged us down when Troy wasn't looking. Told us his plan. Mentioned he'd talk to you. If Luke can tell us what's going on with the guards, we can use that to pick a good time to escape. Huh. That seems reasonable. Who knows when that'll be? Look, Clem had it right. We just need something loud to get their attention. The PA system Carver is always using is quite loud. There's some speakers outside the building, pointed toward the parking lot. I saw them when we were walking out to the work. Troy's always standing next to one of them. There are a few along the roof. He's right. I saw them too. Really? It's all controlled in Bill's office. There's a switch in there that- If I don't on. say it, someone else oh, will. I used to make a lot of the announcements back in the day. I had it flipped on once. Luckily, there wasn't much around at the time to hear it. It was plenty loud, though. That's perfect. Yeah, but wouldn't they cut it out? get into his office. Why didn't you say something sooner? Because it doesn't change anything. This isn't a discussion about how to do it. It's a discussion about whether it's stupid. And it's still stupid. The sensible thing is to get Luke the radio and wait for an opening. You're real difficult to deal with sometimes. Kenny. No, that's all right. You ain't exactly a peach either. Luke's in no shape to help us. You want to put our fate in that guy's hands, it's not happening. He did look pretty rough. You guys should take a look in the mirror sometime. Let them look, argue. It doesn't have to be mutually exclusive. Getting Luke the radio is helpful whatever we end up doing. It doesn't hurt to have more information. You know what? Fine. I can get behind that. Okay. Again, so if I don't say it, someone radio. else will. He keeps us posted on the herd's movement. We fire up the PA thing and bring the walkers to roll over this place. And then what? Get some guns and shoot our way out. I don't know. Whatever we can. We improvise. Then that's not a plan. You don't plan to improvise. I figured out what your problem is. You don't think this stuff through. If the end of the plan is just to stroll through a herd of walkers, then you should know from the jump there's no way it's ever going to work. Actually... I do it all the time. First words I ever hear you say, and it's just some crazy, stupid shit. Hush. What do you mean exactly? When you cover yourself in their smell, rub the walker guts all over you. They can't tell you from one of them. That's what Lee did. Now I don't know who's crazier. Trust me, I've walked through herds before. It works. You just have to keep calm and make sure you're good and covered. Lee figured that out. What? It's how we got out of the Marsh House. Lee covered me and we walked right through. Really? Holy shit. Oh, good one, Lee. All right, what are we waiting for? Let's get that stupid radio. We still have to find a way to get in the stock room. I got a plan for that, too. Come on, kid. Gonna need your help. Oh, God, I have to do it. Where the hell did she come from? We just need to use the winch. She can just climb up from there. Then, just drop into one of the skylights over the stock room. There are shelves and stuff for you to land on, so you probably won't fall to your death. Great. That thing breaks all the time. Unless something's changed, it won't support much weight. Come on, up and at him. Don't push her, Kenny. She's our best bet. I mean that, Clem. Now or never, I guess. That's my girl. We gotta get that rope down. Mike, you wanna boost her up? Come on, kid. Don't let go. I got you. Oh, boy. Oh, god damn, Clem. She's Try such hurry, all right? such a tough cookie, I don't man. I think they're the sharpest guards in the world, but they're no idiots either. They see you're not in your bunk, we're all done. Shit, he's coming back. I gotta let you go. I can't stand here. Grab something.
Yeah, but if they don't see me, won't they? Oh my god! We're in trouble. Yeah, I said we're fucked. Look at that. Well, wouldn't they notice if they don't see me? Now I have to be quiet as a mouse, right? Leave it for the wall. You're not gonna believe what I'm looking at. There's gotta be two or three thousand of them out there. In the parking lot? Oh shit. No, not in the parking lot. I can't see them all, but I see the dust they're kicking off. Oh boy. So you're not sure? What, about how many there are? Yeah. How can I be? Fuck. I hope they pass by us. God, yeah. You think we're ready this time? I don't know. Bill thinks we are. Of course he does, but he felt the same thing last time. I'm literally like right in front. Last time. Is it enough though? We'll find out if they turn this way. Yeah. Yeah. Where do I go? I'm gonna assume somewhere over here, right? Ah. Made me go through all that and it was over here this whole time. Why did I think like you only a little piece open, not the whole damn thing? I like how they send the little girl to do this shit, man. My question is how do I get back? I had a girl. You think we're ready? No. I think so. The homestead, at least. I'm not sure about the expansion. They're out there just moaning. That's what they do. It's driving me crazy. It's really unnerving. I know what you mean. You figured we'd be used to it by now. I wouldn't figure that. You never got used to a light buzzing or anything? A little different when it's dead human beings walking around. I'll give you that one. So what are you doing tomorrow? Bill wants me to start getting this bay door fixed. And while you're down there? Yep. What happened to it again? Troy backed into it when we brought the prisoners, the, the new people in. See, it's hard not to call them prisoners. Anyway, I'm looking at it now. I don't think we have what we need. That's sick really? too? But how do you... There's no way she gets back the same way, right? Oh shit. I'm a fall. Oh, oh, oh my God. I really thought I was going to fall. Whew. You get him? Okay, jump down. I got you. Ah! We best get in bed. Troy will be back any minute. Well? Oh no, why? And then Sarah, Everybody man. Stay where you are. No need drawing suspicion. That was so cool. Thank you, Clem. I told you you probably wouldn't die. Nice job. Now, but what do I do with them? Thanks. Yep. <laughs> anyway, get some rest. Because they're going to see two radios went missing. And obviously suspicious, right? I thought about Duck today. About his dumb little face. <laughs> he was pretty stupid looking. But I love Duck. Always the dumb things he was doing. Kid I don't was care what nobody said. He was annoying. Circles. But I, I like Duck, he man. Went, he was annoying he as shit. Run. But he was still Couldn't a kid, stop. you know? Poor Duck. Makes it I still think a name Duck is kind of... 
a good boy. He was. Well, long day tomorrow. One long day. Poor Kenny, you've been through so much, man. Now all he has left is Clem. Well, Sarita now, but... All right, we're all here. Someone's got to get the radio out to Luke. What's the problem? We should probably figure out who's doing what before we... Oh, we fucked. Time to get up. Daylight's burning. They let you sleep in, all things considered. Where's my dad? He's where the rest of you are going. To work. Damn! Rebecca, Nick, Sarah, Jane. If you gotta take a piss, do it now. The next break won't be for a while. Troy will be coming up for the rest of you. Why just them? Like I said, Troy's coming for the rest of you. Damn. So aggressive, man. All right, look, if we're gonna do something, we have to do it now. And if Luke's all we got, and we pair up with him, I can do it. Where's the meeting? Mike. Yeah? Clementine should do it. Are you fucking kidding? No offense, but come on, that's crazy. She's a kid. Why would- There's a million reasons. She knows Luke. She can hide. She got the damn radio for us in the first place. Who cares? And I'm sorry, Mike, but I don't know you from fucking Adam, all right? And if I'm trusting someone to do something this important, I'm trusting her. You don't trust me to get a radio to someone? Kenny, no. Mike should take it. Clem, why are you pushing her into this? I can do it. It'll work. All right, little chickens. Let's get to pecking. All right. And don't think today's gonna be like yesterday. No way. No shenanigans. This rooster's Damn. gonna be surveilling your ass every second of the day, you hear? Got that? I'm afraid I need an answer, girl. Yes, sir. Come on. Oh, you have your pockets all out. I'm sorry, but it's the only way. Gonna get your tags all snagged on something. That was the most obvious fucking thing, Kenny. Let's go. That was obvious as hell, man. And then look, the radio's pointing out. Hey, she's with me? Oh shit, I almost forgot. Yeah. Well, take her then. I don't care. Damn! Wait, wait, what's going on? Never mind. Just chores of a different sort. Come on, city mouse. Can't you cut her a break? She'd really rather keep with us, people she knows. It's nothing that'll hurt her. Won't they need my help? Well, today I need it more. Come on. Should've gave it to him. I just wanted to make sure you were all right. I found out why you looked so shaken up about Reggie. Bill was just so matter-of-fact about it. Like he'd pulled up a weed or something. Like it had to be done and... It's cause it's who he is! He's a killer! Cold. Goose He's a killer! Up and down your arm. Cause it turns out the person you thought you knew was never there. You look anxious, Clementine. Something the matter? You know you can talk to me, right? Get the fuck out of here, man! I was dishonest when I first met you, but I swear on everything holy that'll never happen again. You can trust me. I can understand you're uncomfortable. I won't force you to be around me if you don't want to. Go on, back out, and be with Kenny. They don't see that radio just sticking out her pocket? Ah, shit. You should get going. Bill don't like idle hands. No one sees this radio sticking out her pocket. Look at that shit! 
Y'all better hurry that shit up. I hate babysitting you assholes. Oh, he's gonna know I was in there. Luke? And Luke's not here. Luke, are you okay? Where are you at? Was he sleeping here? Probably. Oh. Aw, oh, shit. That looks really old. He's probably fine. Where the hell are you at, Luke? I swear to Christ you're gonna regret this. I was... You ain't supposed to be a him. Whew. You people been here one fucking day and already you're fucking up. Well, you wait and see what happens. Move. Hey. Mm-hmm. Fucking Luke, man. They Get found him. And how is it that we're repaid for our trust? With treachery? With deceit? They beat his ass. Left. What's going on? I don't know, Clem. Whatever you were planning is over. It's done. You can't just run from your problems. You can't just up and leave when it gets tough. Because there's nowhere else you can go where it ain't. Tough is all we got now. Get that through your fucking skulls. Oh, shit. Luke here, he can't help you now. You gotta help yourselves. You gotta help me find the strength to forgive you. Now you can start by telling me where the other one is. I'm gonna count to three. If that radio ain't in my hand by then, we'll have to make things more difficult. Nah. One. Two. I got it. I got it right here. Kenny. He about to beat the shit out of Kenny. It's all right. Sorry about that. Not sure what I was thinking. He about to beat the shit out of you, Kenny. Three. <laughs> Fucker. <gasps> God. No! Oh, God. Jesus Ooh. Christ, stop! Stop him! Somebody stop Kenny! him! Kenny! Troy, do Let something! Let me go! Stop. Clementine! Help you me. don't have to do this, Bill! No! Stop it! Get me! Kenny! Kenny! Little shit. Ah, uh, Kenny! Bill! That's enough, Bill! Please! Bill, there's a breach! All right, everyone come with me. Bonnie, you stick around. Make sure these folks don't get into any more trouble. Yeah. Okay. No supper for y'all tonight. Maybe an empty stomach will give you some perspective. And we'll try this again tomorrow. Do your best with him, Carlos. You need to get him able to move, because we're leaving tonight. We're leaving tonight. Fucking Clem, dude. Uh, ow. Dang it. <laughs> What'd she say? She said she can get us out of the pen if we can get the PA system going. Second she hears it, she'll run over and spring us. That's great. It's not great. What are you talking about? Look, I know part of this is my fault. I, I, I know. I was hungry, I got reckless trying to steal some food, and I got caught. Why isn't it great? Because most of us are beat to shit or pregnant. And besides that, it's risky as hell. 
It is pretty damn risky, guys. Damn. Risky? Did you see what that son of a bitch just did? The, the plan works. Nothing needs to change. It's all set up. The hard part is done. This guy's fucking crazy. Who knows what he'll do next? Yeah, but now we're dealing with a guy beat to shit, Sarita in no shape to do anything, and I'm a goddamn mess. Look, we should rest up. Okay, we should bide our time, and we should wait for an opening. Bonnie's agreeing to help us tonight. And that doesn't mean she can't do it some other night. I don't know, guys. Luke's making sense. Maybe we should wait. We're not waiting. Ain't and nothing out there, guys. Trust me, I've looked. There's no food. There's no supplies. They picked everything clean. I'm just saying we gotta be sensible about this. Where's Kenny? Doc's over there working on it. And don't look good. This is what I'm talking about. We're in no shape to go now. Mm. Can I see him? I don't think that's a good idea. His orbital is crushed. I don't think there's much hope for the eye. Damn! I got as stable as I could, cleaned it, got some of the swelling down, bandaged it as best I could. But until he wakes up, we won't know if there's any damage to the brain. <laughs> Fuck. Okay, look. Maybe I'm just playing devil's advocate here, but if... Damn it, if y'all are serious about going tonight, then we're gonna have to start talking about maybe leaving some folks behind. No! There is no other way. This is bullshit. Well, I don't like it either, but guess what? It's where we're at. Kenny and I are only here because of you people, and now you intend to leave us behind. So we should risk all of our lives? What are you saying? Nothing. I'm, I'm just thinking out loud here. Now, now, everyone. Kenny. No, we're not leaving Kenny. That's not fair. We stay together. Life ain't fair, Clem. We're just trying to make the best of a bad situation here. No one wants to leave Kenny. Hmm. Good. Cause you won't have to. I'm all you, right, huh? You tough son of a bitch. We leave tonight. Plan don't change. Not bad, old man. Thanks, asshole. You are one tough bastard. He is. Tough bastards get their ass kicked in front of everybody? Hmm. You alright? That wasn't your fault, okay? It's alright. Hmm. Oh, Uncle Kenny. Alright. Well, then what now? We get the hell out of here. Like now, now. Yes. Where are we going? In case things get squirrely and we gotta make a break for it, we need a place to meet up. We can meet out at Parker's Run. The hell is that? It's a Civil War site a few miles north. Tourist trap. Got signs all over. Just follow the road. We stopped there after we escaped the first time. Luke and Carlos know where it is. It's not that far. Well, at least if a few folks know where it's at, it'll be easier to find if we're split up. All right, that works. Then we just need someone to go set off that PA, right? I mean, you never bother to explain who's supposed to do that. Clementine? Oh my god. Wait, wait, hold on. She's the plan? Why is it always me? Be Bro, sure to man. remember to flip the switch for the outdoor speakers. Just the indoor speakers might not draw the herd. It's right on the microphone box. Right. By default, it's set to play music, so you should just have to turn it on, right? Then climb back up and drop into the stock room. We'll meet you there. Down into the office. Outdoor speaker switch. Turn on PA. Up to the roof. Down into the stock room to meet you guys. That right? Perfect. I still don't know what I'm supposed to do. Be careful. Hey. Kenny is one tough son of a Clem, bitch. Make sure you bring Alvin. What? Yo, they they asked too much of this little girl, man. Seriously. How am I supposed to carry this fucking 400 pound man with me? I'm pretty sure he's not that much, but still, you get you get what I'm trying to say. Hey, Alvin. Come on, boy. 
We gotta go meet the rest, the other chipmunks. Alvin. Let's go. Bro, that dude dead, man. Watch him be a fucking zombie, man. That dude's a fucking zombie, man. Hold on, what is that? Is that whiskey? Is that Tennessee whiskey? Pour me a glass real quick. Wait. Okay, now the mic. Wrong. See, they would have, they would have disconnected it, right? No, 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 no. Where are they? Oh boy. Oh, <laughs> no! Well, come on, man. Come on, come on. Please work. This Fourth of July, make sure your backyard barbecue is complete. Run, Clem. Line of products to meet your grilling needs. I knew it. Oh. Alvin, are are you okay? Woo! Carver talks all that tough guy shit. Then keeps the tiniest gun in the universe. <laughs> There's something funny about that. You tough son of a bitch. They're coming. Come on, we have to go. I ain't going anywhere. But you are. Go on. I mean to get some payback. No, we're leaving. We're all leaving. No, Alvin. I ain't fit to move, kid. Uh, I've, I've run out of road. He's gonna sacrifice Let's, himself. No, I'll, I'll just go up there and shut that thing off. You gotta get out of here. They'll be here any second. Thank you. You take care of my girls. And get the feeling it's, it's gonna be a girl. Just a hunch. Go on. <laughs> Damn! Oh. Oh. Fuck. Oh, man. Uh oh, here they come. You want to disrespect me? Fine. You want to throw away the of life? Of course. I'm trying to build oh, for us all. Oh fucking course. And fucking fine. You want to run off with this dog shit group of crippled fucks? Then fine. Be my guest. Stop but looking I will at me. Put a bullet in you and that baby before I let you leave again with my child. Woo! <laughs> 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 Woo! Get his ass. Get back. No, fuck. Shoot him. Come on, Luke. This ain't none of your business. Clem, where... Why isn't Alvin with you? Where is he? Alvin! Kill him. Rebecca, Don't. I am... Oh, God, I am so sorry. Kill him. Rebecca, Rebecca, sweetie, my God. How did we get here, you and me? This is just a bit of a custody battle we got on our hands here. Shoot him. Just shoot him. What? No, I just... <laughs> Woo! Atta boy, Kenny. Here we go. Oh, shit. <laughs> Go on and wait outside. We have to go. Kenny, please. I only 
need a minute. Go on. You don't need to see this. That girl's already seen more than you can imagine. Shut your mouth, Bill. You're all just gonna let him do this? Yes. There ain't one part of that son of a bitch I don't hate, but that does not make this right. I'm not going anywhere. It's gonna get messy. I know. Y'all go, Look man. You. you fucking ingrates. I don't even know how good you got it. Like, after everything they've been through, they really are like, Oh, That's no. Right. Let him go. Let him go. We don't have to kill him. Fuck it wrong with you people. Slur. No shepherd to guide you. Clementine knows exactly what I'm talking about. Come on. Come on, Clem. Fucking big man, huh? Let's go. No, I'm not letting you see this. It's not your decision. Atta girl. She ain't afraid to look at me, I. You go with that feeling you got right now, Clementine. That's what makes you stronger than Come the rest on. of them. Let's go. Yeah, go on. Let the sheep out of the pen. We'll see how long that lasts. In a I'm world like this, there is nothing wrong with compassion, but you Don't have to be strong, too. How's that I? Just follow my voice. It'll get you there. You got a big fucking skull, Kenneth. Should have put you out of your misery right then. Now look at you. You're a mess. Woohoo, oh, Kenny! What the fuck are you looking at, bitch? Don't act like you didn't love every second of it. Damn! Woohoo! <laughs> God damn! Damn, Kenny. I ain't gonna lie, I did the same fucking thing. He took my eye. Let's go. Why did I just realized he had the gun? Why didn't he pull it out? We got enough to worry about. Man, we're never gonna make it through this. You kidding me? If Clem can handle it, you can. Shit. I thought they were coming from the south. They did. Looks like we're in the eye of it now. Fuck. This is fucked. Here. You're gonna need something. Thanks. Shit. I guess I'll be the one. You guys better hurry up and get to smearing if you want to live. Ugh. You can die here. Doesn't matter to me. Do it quick. We need to get covered before the rest of them get close or we're fucked. How much Clem has grown? I'll go first. You're gonna put that on yourself? We Ugh. have to, Sarah. Ugh. It's gross, man. Okay, now you. Turn what? around. Why isn't your dad doing this? Oh, shit. Everybody shut the fuck up. It'll be okay, honey. Just stay still. Uh, are you sure? I'm sure. There's nothing to fear if you remain calm. I'll keep you safe. That girl gonna panic. I know she is. Hurry the fuck up. Turn around. I'll get your back. We ain't got all day here. Everybody ready? They're almost told what us. What in the actual fuck is going on here? What is this sick shit? Someone say something before I start. Hey, 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 hey! Don't you even fucking think about it, motherfucker. I will end you, you hear me? Troy. Troy, we talked about this. What? The fuck you talking about? I told you I wanted to get out. You said you'd help, then I'd help. I 
thought you meant get out of the pen, not whatever the fuck this shit is. I did. Damn. But now we can leave. Joy, you can come with us. What? Well, where would we go? Away from here. Together. Man, you smell really bad. You gotta get a bath before we- <laughs> Oh my god! She shot him in the dick! Don't make any noise, got it? We might hear something they don't like. And for fuck's sake, walk. Act like you belong, and you will belong. That's crazy. Oh god, there she goes. She's shaking. We got this, y'all. Is that taken? Where's Bill? We need him up here. Somebody's gonna bite the dust, they always do. Watch Sarah. Clementine, come help me. What? what? Please, just say something, you're a friend. already bit no not her arm she'll scream come on come on move You gotta move. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> Sarah's glasses. She's gonna get someone killed. You didn't have to take the radio. Carver wouldn't have hurt me like this. Of course I had to. No telling what that asswipe would have done to you. So how's it look? Am I still gonna be pretty when this heals? Oh, God. You need to get past that walker without drawing all the others. What are you gonna do? Not now. Not now, Dad. Where the fuck is Luke? The Luke's always vanishing, all right? Die, Clementine. Don't let them pull you down with them. Oh man. Well, she's dead. Sarita's dead. Considering that she wasn't in the preview for the next one, I, I would say she's either dead right then and there as soon as it starts, or somewhere in that episode she's gonna die. Which is kind of crazy, because I don't know how Sarah's going to make it. Because that girl is... But now that her dad's died, the one that's protected her at all times, oh, she's finished, dude. She's finished. Now, she ain't going to be able to do shit. <laughs> I, man... I didn't think Carver was going to get killed off that fast in one episode. Well, technically, he's been mentioned throughout, you know, the episodes, and he was in episode two, but... Damn! I, I, I thought he had a bigger role to play. Okay, well, um... Hey, he put the ass whooping on Kenny. God damn, he beat the shit out of Kenny. 
Ah, uh, all right. Well, anyways, guys, let me know what you think. As always, like, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Um, we have two more to go. I, I am gonna finish it this week. I am probably right after I upload this one. I'll do the next one. Um, so I'm trying to go through this season because I want to start the next two seasons going in blind because I haven't played them. So it's gonna be. I'm trying to get through this, man. But damn, man, it's such a like going back and reliving these moments and doing I forget how good season two really was man this is crazy I don't know what I don't I don't know like it's just damn man but it's only gonna get more wild it's only gonna get more crazy from here so let me know what you think as always like subscribe and let me know what you think and two more to go I'll catch you on the next one. Take it easy, guys.